don't tell me they've all gone AWOL. Hi guys and welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. Ah, uh, it's a little more relaxing today because we don't have to rush into the, for the end of the season. So we can walk around and we can say good morning to Baldwina. Not sure what's happened to Ingarda. Maybe she's still in bed. Why is, actually, that's a good question. Why is Baldwina? No, that's Ingarda. Hmm. Did they change clothes? Maybe Bo <laughs> I'm getting my villagers confused. Sorry, Ingarda. Um. Oh. No, they are, in fact. Okay. I'm sure she was wearing purple yesterday. Huh. Anyway, maybe they do. Anyway, so we are back. I'm a, yes, again, a little more relaxed. I'm um, still probably as scattered as always. Noticing a few little things around the place. Like number one, our bear trap is doing nothing. So I think it's not placed well. Not sure if we can, if we we can't destroy it. So we may have just, we might just have to put up with that one for a while. But I did put our uh, rabbit trap over here now. So a little bit away from the, the hustle and bustle. So today, as said in previous episode, which I'm doing back to back episodes, if you uh, made any comments that I needed to address, I haven't seen them yet. But let's build our tavern. Now, I am a bit excited about the tavern. I, because we, it has been, I have been waiting for this one for a while. Now we need quite a number of logs, but to start with, I think we can take, oh, not many. Oh, we've got fur and meat. Oh, I forgot. I was, I was staying up late cooking. And as soon as I finished cooking, he fell over. The change of season caused him to pass out. So, so we've got lots of food on us, but look at that. There we go. Our villagers are definitely not going to starve. All right. So now we've got some weight. Good. Okay. And we, and we got, uh, we got a full stomach because of the change of season. So now, okay. <laughs> this guy, this game for something that's so relaxing, it's stressful. <laughs> All right. 11 logs, that should do it for the moment. Eee, that should more than do it. Holy cow, 27. 25. All right, well, we'll start off with this. I'm pretty sure we can... Oh, we'll put the fur away. Yeah, I also created a lot of simple bags. Ah, that explains that. To sell, the next time we go into town... Uh, because I noticed we had a lot of leather... Which reminds me, we should adjust while I'm in here. Let's go into the sun. Um, let's get the menu up. Let's adjust uh, the hunter. We're not using fur at the moment. We need a recipe. So I think we're going to wind back on the fur, but we're, we can make manufacture things with the leather. So we'll, we'll balance that out a bit. All right, good. Uh, and berries, um, it's not summer anymore, so no, no, you don't want, let's reduce you. I'm not sure how this works, whether it's, it just does that when it's possible. I don't know. Let's get some feathers. No, we can't. Oh, they must be by the, um, the hunter. All right. So let's do the mushrooms. Yeah, let's get mushrooms. Now, they can do quite well as, as long as they don't collect the poisonous ones. Uh, I don't think the berries are edible at the moment. We certainly can't sell them. So hopefully, well, we'll see what happens with that. I didn't, I, I didn't experiment with that one. Right. So we've changed those guys. Let's pull out our hammer. That's not a hammer. That's a hammer. All right. So now I want to put the um, tavern here. Let's take all these sticks. Well, we're overloaded anyway. And we're going to lose them if once we put the tavern here. Now I want to put the tavern here uh, because 
it's open. So it gives a place for our villagers to hang out. And if we put it near the water, it's just a beautiful place for them to hang out. And you know, that's got to make them happier, right? <laughs> Not sure it's part of the game mechanic, but from a uh, an immersion point of view, it should make them happier to be able to see it. Now, this is the problem. When we upgrade, not sure where we're going to put it, but yeah. Oh, let's get the rocks. The stones, sorry, the stones on the rocks. All right, good. Nice. Now, now we want to put it here. And we want to move it over a bit. So just in case we decide we want to enclose it later. Not sure. I think I might just leave this uh, tavern here forever. It will take a lot of, uh, no, we want resources, not storage. Crafting, crafting. Yeah. Oh, uh oh. Can't, we can't do it? Surely we can do it. No. Oh, well, that's, oh, there we go. We can do it here. <laughs> ah, okay. Is that the front door? I can. Never see these big buildings. We should be able to zoom them. I hope they do that before the before it becomes full release because that's a bit painful. Ah, oh, there we go. Now can we shuffle over? <laughs> Actually, you know what? We'll leave it over a bit because if we choose to expand in future, I think the next one is a bit bigger. And also, you know, we'll we'll have a nice little area here. We don't want to take up all of the space yeah i think that works i think that works all right so have we got anything on us that we can use sticks nice all right so we need one log and we've got lots of sticks uh-huh okay good good well let's use up these sticks we need lots of logs so we'll just put everything in this will be a couple of trips back i think and, uh, oh, that's right. It doesn't fully enclose, so we don't have to do it all. Okay, so we've got one. Well, this guy gets his breath back. We need straw and log. Uh, the, and then, are we going to need to do the inside? No. So we've got one, two, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, a dozen. We'll just pick these. Oh, you know what? We'll leave those for <laughs> after we get the logs. All right, so then we have to take care of the farm so now we've got a bit of a problem we need to get more workers for the farm oh look at those logs and firewood ah a wood chopper you are amazing okay six eight ten that's in garda isn't it in garda you are amazing ten i think that you know what let's just take 12 just in case we'll grab some straw um, yep. And we'll put the stones in because they are very, very heavy. All right, I think we can waddle. Yeah, we can waddle. Okay. Well, I guess we could have got the straw later, but we've got lots of it. And we were lucky enough, I'm pretty sure we didn't suffer any damage with the change of seasons there. So that is good. So, let oh, I forgot the end bits. Ooh. Oh, well. <laughs> I bought extra logs, so hopefully this will finish it off. Oh, it's only one end bit. Good, nice. Okay, guys, I think I'm just going to finish this off, and I will bring you back in when she's done. All right, we're about to finish, and I made a new hammer just in case. Ah, <laughs> nice. All right, there is our lovely tavern. Nice. Now, no rest for the wicked. Let's, uh, oh, hang on. Have we got, we, we can put the straw and stick away. All right. So that was the tavern. Okay, boom. This village is coming along now. Once we have a tavern, it's all good. And it is a true trivia. It's at the corner of three roads. There we go. Nice. Okay. Probably I would have liked it a bit closer to here. But it does open this area up because I I did kind of chop this uh, <laughs> a bit close to the corner there. But anyway, all right, still no birds. 
oversight on my part. Well, let's go and pick these cabbages. Oh my God. How many do we get? 12? 12 cabbages, wow. Nice, and one seed we're getting. <laughs> well, at least they're replacing themselves. And the good news is we didn't have to get any special equipment as long as it's not uh, wearing out my hammer that's in my hand. All right, so we've got six. Now, what, what month is it? It's autumn. Okay, let me just check my uh, writing down here. Autumn, we can do rye. So rye, not a huge thing for um, from a perspective because that's another thing that we have to get bowls and everything for. So I may put that off for the moment, but we can still, okay, 14 seeds from 11. So, okay, cabbage grew a little bit. Uh, but the rye, well, not only can we turn that into, um, what was it, gruel, we can also uh, sell the seeds. So I am going to plant that this season, but it's the only thing we need. But look at that, 95 cabbages. Good. We are ready for when we become a pottage industry. Okay. Good. All right. So let's grab those bags and get into town. So we've done our farming. It's the first day we've done our farming. Let's put on our uh, repair hammer. And there's no damage around the village. Nice. We have we have a tavern. Let's take that off because everything looks very, very ugly. Oh, I didn't check this guy up here. Repair? Nothing? No. Okay. The other thing we have to do before we take off. So there's our tavern. Oh, yes. Village. I think we've got the officially a small village. All we need is a church <laughs> and it's an official village. All right. Okay. Um, leather sticks. Now, there are no axes or anything here. So let's craft some axes because I'm not sure. Hold on. We'll, well, we can't move anywhere, but let's have a quick squeeze at the management. They may have already gone through their, um, their, oh no, they're, 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 they're working, but let's just, let's just make a few, five of each, just to make, to be on the safe side. So we'll do five, uh, E, one, two, no, 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 not that one. Uh, how do I do one? D, D, or five. Okay, so we'll do five knives, because there's none in here. I don't know whether they've grabbed them and put them on themselves or um, or they've used them already. They still, maybe the crossing of the season, they use up a certain amount like happens with food. Anyway, we will see. We'll do five of each and we'll see at the end of the season. And maybe they will complain that they have no tools um, before then. So we will be able to see. But anyway, let's do some axes. Uh, let's do five, three, four, five. Good. And then after we've done this, we can throw everything back in and we will be good. Although five seconds for an ax. It does seem to count faster. I don't know. It seems to go faster than it used to. Maybe because they've added milliseconds or maybe there was milliseconds. It just seems to work faster now. Anyway. All right, there's five axes. Excellent. Let's open you. Now, so, <laughs> no more making knives and axes to sell into ta in town. We're making them just to stay afloat. All right. So, goody. All right, so where are the bags? We've got 25 simple bags to sell. Is there anything else we can sell? We can no longer sell six. We've got lots of logs. Good, because we're going to need another house. So we need to find, oh, we don't need a hammer. Let's put the hammer over here. Uh, we don't need the fur stuff. Oh, ho, oh, if we get a, a farmer. So pretty much anybody with a three will work for us at the moment because we need we need a farmer um, or two, two craftspeople. 
Okay, good. Okay, so let's do the town rounds after. Oh, hang on. Oh, we've got a skill point. What can we put that into? Oh, okay. So, yeah. Now, I want to move towards Mule because I am getting sick of not being able to carry many logs. So, what we're going to have to do is something in this second tier so we can get to Mule? Where are you? Mule. This one. There's Mule. So, I think it's this one. Uh, force of nature. Axe durability. Yeah, well, I hope that works for my villagers as well. So, let's just do that. F that. So next time we can become a mule. Good. All right. Now, food. Food for ourselves. And how are those rolled oats doing? Did they get eaten? Oh, look at this. Mushrooms are plenty. Yeah. Oh, and we got some rust too. Bonus. Oh. Oh, that was our rolled oats. They didn't eat it. Damn it. Okay. Um, let's take some berries. Let's have a quick squeeze at our health. F. Oh, uh, uh, tab. Uh, inventory. Okay, so 34 berries. Let's have 34 berries. Uh, I thought I was done with that torch, but no, apparently I, I can't leave it alone. All right, 34. Eh. Okay, that's it. We'll take 36. <laughs> a snack for later. All right. Let's just eat those. Nice. Oh, hang on. What? Oh, we're only getting half for a berry. Oh, no. Miscalculation. That's all right. We can survive. All right. And... Oh, let's grab... Because we might have to do the rounds. So let's grab some spears just for the walk. Uh, we'll grab you... You, and, you know what the hell, we'll just grab everybody. And we'll put that in. Nice. And let's put it in our hand. So of course we're also going to pop over and, and have a little chat with Godsy Mira. So actually, let's just check our cleanliness. We're 7%. Dirty. We cannot go to Godsy Mira anything less than zero. Oh, it's not working. <laughs> let's swim. Whoosh, whoosh. Okay. That's gonna work. Yeah, boom. Okay. Alright. So let's get back to Godzimira. Check with her. Now see if some new guys have rocked up to the fire. We want craftsmen. I've decided craftsmen are the key. We can get um Oh. Uh, yeah, I think what I'm going to do is I'll keep going with the uh, field work and stuff until, um, until we can get some more houses on the go. Because we still need to upgrade the ones we've got. So there's going to have to be some housing maintenance done soon. So our priority here, given a choice our priority will be to get a craftsperson. So let's hope that apart from the beautiful god Zimira, we've got a craftsperson over here. Okay, spear away. Don't want to threaten them. Now, uh, there. What's this guy? He's a nothing. Okay. God Zimira. Oh, god Zimira can work on the farm. Ooh. Hey, god Zimira. Up for a little bit of marriage yet? Beautiful lady! 56, all right. Beautiful eyes. Uh... Yes! Yes! <laughs> I can never remember from one moment to the next what compliments work on this woman. Uh, beautiful lady. Amazing dress. Now, I know that doesn't work. And, you know... 62. I'm just not sure whether she's going to like me being a strong man. I don't think I don't think she's going to like that. She's a farm worker. Oh, she might. Oh, oh. Ah. Oh. Okay, okay. Sorry, Godzimira. I I was a little bit conceited there. My apologies. <laughs> oh, hello. It bug. Uh, oh, oh, which reminds me. Where's the bag? No. 
Gotard. All right. Let's go and sell our wares. <gasps> oh, I just for did we pay our taxes? I forgot all about that. Have we paid them? <gasps> Oopsies! We're gonna pay our taxes. Lucky we did made earn some cash. Um, show me your wares. Okay, so you want some simple bags? Fourteen a pop. That should cover our taxes. Okay, three fifty nine. Ooh, I don't know if it has. So let's check out the prices here, actually. Meat with gravy. So we get basically a third. So 20 and 15 for gruel and pottage. Yeah, look at that. I mean, 70. And, and they cost the same. If you look in the management, it, hello, uh, I'll go now. Thank you. If you look at the management uh, technology underneath the tavern, you yeah, look. The meat with gravy and you get less for it. Pottage is cheaper. Although, how is it to make? Roast meat, one meat versus three meat. But wooden bowl for both of them. In fact, are they all wooden bowls now? Oh, they are. Meat with gravy. Okay. Oh, no, it is a... Okay. Anyway. <laughs> I guess it's no real effort more. It's just more management. All right. So we've got cash. Better pay our taxes. Hello, Unigos. Don't want to. I want to pay my debt. Thank you. The king will be pleased. I am his loyal servant. Uh, okay, I'll go now. Goodbye. Ciao, ciao. Um, so now, how much money do we have? Let's have a check our inventory. Uh, coins, 94. Not quite enough to buy a recipe yet but that's okay our villagers can survive on um on roast meat for the moment all right so let's hope we find a craft person over in borrowo and then i will be happy because that's one less thing. Oh, stones. Yeah, stones. One less thing I will have to worry about. So I'm collecting stones so we can upgrade houses. Oh, mushrooms. Snacky food. But I'm not going to spend the whole episode just collecting. Uh, no. Uh, this is this man sells our spoons. Follibor, Follibor. Sells our spoons. He's a good man, that one. He's a good man, fellow. Uh, the only problem is I do not want to make any more spoons. My God, they take forever. Ah! Nobody! Nobody! No! Oh, my God. Change of season. Oh, look at the new chicken house. Isn't that nice? Much better. Much better. The chickens really had a <laughs> bit of a time leaping up in the last one. Ah! Uh, Oh, oh, but Lambert has it. No, I, you know, we've got things to do. Sorry, Lambert. All right. Let's see if we can find somebody at uh, Barankia. I know we do go all over the place, but in search of villages, isn't it amazing? The, <laughs> the amount of work one has to get to to get a village up and running. All right, let's go. Now, remember pigs. Pigs are in these hills. Okay. All righty, nobody here. Oh, and Wysant. I don't want to play with any Wysant because we've got lots of meat, Mr. White. Oh, there's a pig, though. Yeah, let's stay away from him. Let's... Oh, yeah, we haven't... <laughs> There's a, uh, a skill you can get that enables them to be highlighted in red if they're uh, an aggro-ish mob. Uh, sorry, if, they, if they're if they a boar that gets angry, we can see them red, or a wolf even. But um, we don't have that. <laughs> I've been taken back to my roots. All right. Let's see if we can find a crass person here, because I really would like to stop worrying about whether we've got enough cooked meat. 
All right. So we're fine as far as our uh, food and water is concerned. All right, what do we got here? Oh, don't tell me they've all gone AWOL. No, oh no, there's a couple. Okay, there's one. Whew. Okay, what do we got? What do we have? Uh, okay, we got a farmer. All right, we're going to have to settle for a farmer because there's a bonus. He's a boy. <laughs> Ingata will be thankful to us, I hope. Um, 24, good age for her. Okay, do you have a minute? Now, he's a farmer. Remember that. I'm not sure what that means, but... Uh, peasant, farmer, noble, recently got any tips? Yeah, that was, Yeah, we're not going to get him today. Okay, hi, how have you been? Yeah, good. How have you been? Would be good. Gossip. Gossip. He's a gossiper. Yeah. Uh, do you have a minute? Ooh. Okay. Just got back from working in the field. Boom. There we go. Got a settlement. And I want you to join. Good. Because I need a farmer. Lootable. Lootable. All right. Success there. We didn't get our... Um, all right, Ingata, yeah, 26, 24. You guys are in for some children. I can see this. I'm arranging a marriage here. <laughs> All right, workplace. Now, yeah, he's a farmer and he's always going to be a farmer. So our tavern is not going to get... Uh, ooh. We don't need him to do any stuff at the moment, but we can prepare yeah he's got a horrible skill so yeah we can't get him to do anything else so he's going to be a crop worker at the moment good all right well while we're here we can do something with our crops then we can tell him well we can suggest to him oh what am i thinking here uh now what did i say autumn autumn is the month of the rye now we do need to get well look it doesn't matter if he can't plant it he'll just say sorry no so we'll just fill this all up uh we don't we only got enough fertilizer for six rye at the moment we're gonna have to make some money yes all right good well at least he's got something to do all right good success so now <laughs> now we have to build some more houses so we can get a tavern keeper. All right, how's our weight? Uh, we've got lots of weight, so we can collect on the way home. Oh, mushrooms. All right. So we've really done everything we need to do today. So I think, guys, I think I'm going to let you go early this week because there's nothing really that we, we have to do once we get home. Basically, I've just got to collect the materials so we can build a house. Although, our villagers have been exceptional of late. My wood chopper, Ingara, oh my god, she's amazing. And she has collected a lot of wood. But I don't want to take anything for granted. So I think as we are wandering into this autumn view, isn't this amazing, these autumn trees? I think I'm going to say goodbye. So thank you very much for joining me in this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the episode. And give the bell a little bit of a tickle if you want to receive regular updates. Alright guys, thank you very much once again for joining me. And I hope to see you next time.